Okay, so this is a lesson on Nothing Holding You Back by Shawn Mendes. Okay, the intro, what you want to do is put your middle finger on your sixth string third fret, and then you want to have your index finger on your fourth string second fret, and your hammer on finger is going to be on your fourth string uh, fourth fret. So you, over here, you're going to play your sixth string and then mute the note right away. So we play it and mute it, and then we play the fourth string, and then we hammer it on, and then we play it again. So you're going play and mute. So you play the six, four hammer, and then once you have that, your next one is your fifth string on the second fret, and then you want your fourth string on the fourth fret and your hammer on note is going to be with your baby finger on the fourth string sixth fret. So here you're going. So you've got your fifth string with your thumb here and then and then you play your fourth string with your finger here. So you're going. So so far we have sixth string third fret You go to this one where you're on your fifth string second fret and then your fourth string fourth fret and your hammer on is on your fourth string sixth fret. From here you go to open A string which is your fifth string open and here you're playing uh, your fourth string second fret hammering onto your fourth string fourth fret. Sorry. So that's the intro to the song. Let's go through that again. Now getting into the chords, um, we can play these in a few different ways. Play a G chord. So you're going to play G, slap, G, slap, to D. Then you're going to do a kind of funny uh, B minor. So if your D chord is like this, you're going to take, leave this finger where it is, and these two fingers, you're going to move them up two strings, which means your index finger will be on your fifth string second fret, and your middle finger will be on your third string second fret. So practice going from your D to your B minor there. Okay, so once you have that, let's try it from the beginning. G slap, D, B minor, slap, B, now go to your A, slap, D, A, slap, D, G, slap, D, And it keeps going like that through the whole song. Another way you can do it is to play it with power chords. So a power chord position kind of looks like this. So we're going to have our index finger on our 6th string 3rd fret. And then our 4th uh, finger is on our 5th string 5th fret. And our baby finger is on the 4th string 5th fret. And you can play that. So we have that, which is a G chord. And then we're going to move in that same position. So our index finger is on our fifth fret, fifth string. And our other two fingers just go and fall into place there. And this, so then you play that once. So, so far we have this. Now we're going to slide this all the way down to our second fret. Let's try it from the beginning. So you have your G chord. There we go. Can we go back up to our fifth fret? Now here to get our A chord, we're going to move everything up one string. 
right down. Let's try that again. So we start on our G. There's the song.